What's going on there, guys? My name is Matt, or Chewy, as most of you will know me as, and today is our announcement for our next Twitch tour. We've done four tours so far on our live stream since the start of 2017. It's been two months now since we finished our Around the World in 80 Legs tour, and today is the announcement for us to start our fifth tour. On the screen, you see an absolutely beautiful 747400 painted in the Iron Maiden Book of Souls livery. And this is the aircraft that we're going to be touring next. Iron Maiden, if you don't know them, are an incredibly famous rock band. Um, they are hugely successful and have been for a number of decades now. And their lead singer is also a pilot. In 2016, they embarked on a world tour to uh, re after the release of their uh, one of their latest albums at the time it was, um, as I say, called the Book of Souls World Tour, um, where the uh, the lead singer flew them in the 747. They took their crew, they took all of the three different stage sets and various other bits of equipment and uh, leased the aircraft from Air Atlanta Icelandic. They also had cabin crew and other pilots from that airline who joined them on the tour. I'm a big fan of Iron Maiden, and as a lot of you know, I'm also a big fan of the 747. And so I thought this would be an absolutely incredible idea for us to do for our next tour on the stream. On the screen now, as I do with every single tour that I create, I make a Google My Maps of it all. And you can see here all of the legs. All of the blue airports listed here are airports that we have scenery available for in uh, prepared version four. Uh, the two yellow uh, airports, which is Edmonton and then Christ, uh, sorry, Auckland, um, are sceneries where we've had scenery airports announced, but they've not been released yet. By complete and utter chance, for all of the other 45 or so airports, I think it is, um, there is scenery already released and available and working in P3D, which is very, very, very lucky. It's just these two here that we're waiting on. Um, you will have a link down to this Google My Maps in the description below. I'm not going to go through every single individual leg on this world tour during this video. Um, but if you click on an airport, you'll not only be able to see the name of the airport, but I've also posted a link to where you can purchase the airport or download the airport if it's freeware. So if you are wanting to do this tour yourself or you're wanting to join along with me and complete the tour as I do it on my uh, Twitch live stream, you'll have a link to know what scenery is being used for all of that. Before we go any further, and as I bring up another screen now, um, you can see this spreadsheet on the right hand side. And this, uh, all of the credit for this spreadsheet goes to one of our subscribers and uh, viewers on the live stream called Dom2364. He reached out to me as he's got a friend who actually helped plan this real world tour back in 2016. And so he got in contact with his friend who sent over some information. And Dom has kindly created this absolutely amazing spreadsheet for us, which details um, the letter egg, the call sign that was used, the origin, the destination, the date, uh, the schedule time of departure and when it actually departed and then it's uh, when it was supposed to uh, depart and its actual um, arrival time as well. It's also got a list of its uh, scheduled block time and how long the blocks or the flights actually took and yeah there you go how long the actual flight times were um, and he's also put together a list of the routings that they uh, used as well. Don't know how accurate these routings will be now with the latest AIRAC data but they're a cool basis to go off. Um, and then he's also put a nice little section on the right-hand side here of notes. Um, those of you who will have seen this aircraft before may have known that um, on one of the flights it occurred major engine damage after a ground vehicle crashed into one of the engines um, and, uh, and delayed things for a bit. But they got it fixed and continued on in the world tour. So we've got a list of all of the flights over the course of the tour. It's 47 legs in total. Um, and you can see here that the uh, the total flight time is expected to be just under 130 hours of flying in this 747, which certainly sounds like um, a good thing to me. So I'm really looking forward to starting this tour. In terms of starting the tour, it's going to be kicking off this next week. Today is Sunday, the 4th of August, 2019, and we are going to start it on Wednesday, the 7th of August, 2019. Now, you're probably saying, Chewy, you always used to do your tours on a Tuesday. Why are you saying it's going to start on a Wednesday? Well, um, as you can see here on the uh, on the flight times, we've got quite a lot of variation between the flight lengths. We've got flights that are nine hours, then two hours, then 30 minutes. 
And so because of this, it's not going to be a scheduled day of the week that we do this tour. Um, for flights that are of a reasonable length, you know, two hours, one hours, then we will happily do them on a on a Tuesday as usual. But for these really long flights, the nine hour flights, there's an 11 hour flight here from LAX to, um, to Tokyo. We'll either do them on a Wednesday as a split stream long haul, um, or I may do them as an overnight thing. So for example, we will on a Friday evening at the end of the streaming week, I will take off from LAX. And then on Saturday morning, I will record the arrival to put onto YouTube and to put on my live stream. So there's going to be a bit of variation. It's not going to be a set thing where every single Tuesday we do one or two more legs of this uh, uh, Book of Souls tour. It will vary depending on the nature of the routes that's coming up. If you want to stay up to date as to what, uh, you know, when I'm going to be flying these legs on the tour, uh, I will pop a link down in the description below to our Discord server and I will post in there um, what the plan is and when we're going to be uh, doing the next flights. But as I say, to start off, it'll be kicking off on Wednesday, the 7th of August 2019 with the first route from uh, Cardiff to Fort Lauderdale. So that's that. That is the world tour announced. If I've forgotten anything, I'll pop it down in the description below. You will have access to this Google My Maps here on the left hand side where you'll be able to click on the airports and everything can download scenery if you would like to do it. Um, yourself. Unfortunately, I'm not allowed to make this spreadsheet publicly available with everything. I mean, you guys can see it here. So if you wanted to grab a screenshot um, of the block times and things, um, you're welcome to do so, I guess. But I I don't think I'm going to be allowed to fully reveal the routes. Dom's just asked uh, because, you know, he's he's asked a friend um, to give him this information, just that we don't, um, you know, try to abuse the amount of information that we've been sent, if that makes sense. Uh, alone, he sent me a hell of a lot of very useful information um, so I appreciate that enough but um, you know you'll have access to the Google My Maps all of the scenery is linked into there and then if you join the Discord server you'll be able to tell um, on what days we are doing uh, what routes on the tour um, but that's that folks I'm really excited to start on this it's going to be really good fun um, as I say Iron Maiden are one of my favorite bands um, and uh, the 747-400 is my favorite aircraft so this is going to be a really 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 fun tour I think I'm going to enjoy it more than uh, any of the other tours that we've done so far quite frankly it's the one that I am most excited for Right, that's it for me today. Thanks for tuning into this quick little video for our announcement. I hope you're excited. If you are, let me know if you're going to join me on this tour or whether you're going to complete it yourself down in the comment section below. And uh, I will see you again next week. Thanks very much for watching, guys.